Every day, thousands of traffic accidents occur around the world. Some of them are relatively minor, others result in more serious injuries. As early as the beginning of the 1970s, Volvo cars started their own traffic accident research into all more serious accidents where Volvo cars were involved. Real traffic accidents have given Volvo invaluable knowledge as to how to build safer cars. We are looking mainly to understand what has happened, so we look for signs, skid marks or whatever, to understand how the accident has occurred and to be able to understand why it happened as well. And after that we look more at the car, look for the safety details as the seat belts, how they work, airbags, uh, the structure of the body and so on. Research operations on site help investigators to understand how and why different types of personal injuries occur. No two accidents are the same. By collecting field data, this gives us an extremely good chance to be among the best uh, performing uh, car manufacturers in real life safety. Today there are some 36,000 investigated traffic accidents in Volvo's archives in Gothenburg. Accidents that, over the years, have been a great help in the development of safer cars. Many pioneered safety features have resulted from these studies. Things that we developed from this uh, knowledge database are uh, whiplash protection systems, side impact systems, uh, child restraint systems. Every year, Volvo Traffic Accident Research investigates some 100 traffic accidents. Very quickly after an accident occurs, investigators are called in by the emergency services in order to start their investigations at the scene of the accident and produce a preliminary report. Thereafter, considerably more comprehensive investigation operations begin in order to find solutions that can reduce the number of serious personal injuries. The accident research team's work during all these years has helped us to improve safety in the cars in a continuous process by learning from the cars on the road to improve the cars to be. Sometimes a reconstruction of the accident is carried out, both to under controlled conditions, understand what has happened, as well as to try and ensure that the test methods and crash test dummies that are used react as realistically as possible. Five, four, two, two, one. Today, Volvo also puts a great deal of effort into investigating why a traffic accident has occurred. It is exactly in this area that many researchers believe that new knowledge will be found. I use the data very much to understand what priorities there are, uh, what areas to improve with respect to safety. I also use the data to understand the mechanisms behind different types of accidents or injuries knowledge that will lead to new technological solutions that will help prevent or reduce the number of accidents.